So uh, we're getting ready for uh, another cold day on the water. And a few things that I've been uh, investing in just to make sure that I stay pretty warm. Um, starts from the bottom up. So these are boundary boots. These are all NRS stuff. Been uh, lucky enough to get my hands on. So these boundary boots, a bit different than what I'm used to seeing. Uh, a lot of them have a very thin version of these boots. Um, uh, where you'd have a very thin neoprene if, or a shell up top with neoprene down at the boot. This is all neoprene. It's neoprene worked all the way through on these boundary boots. And what they do is then they reinforce it uh, with harder rubber in the key places. So your, your wear and tear on the bottom, wear and tear on the front, wear and tear on the sides are all kind of taken care of. So when you're banging into rocks and stuff like that, wading through water, uh, these do a good job. But most importantly, because it's neoprene all the way through, and just the way it tucks with these bibs, just down like that. What happens is you tighten this sucker up is when water does get, your legs do get exposed to the water, uh, you stay warm. And this part, like I said, isn't a shell. It is neoprene all the way up. So you got warmth from here down uh, minimum. Lightweight bib, and I finish off with a nice top of jacket with a whole bunch of layers of the uh, just to make sure that I'm warm. Little hydro skin on the hands, so when my paddle drip does happen, my hands stay warm too. And we're off to get some musky on Lake Murmur.